Hey everybody, welcome back. And I am back with a, another Dollar Tree haul. Um, I know I just did one. And uh, I gotta tell you, I went back in. This is two different um, stores that I went to. Um, I went back in and I found all new stuff that I didn't see just a couple days ago. So I must have gotten there in between like a truck day. Uh, I found all this really, really great stuff. Um, so yeah, so let's get started and I will show you everything that I picked up. I did get a lot of food. I mean, why not? First, I grabbed the breakfast biscuits. Now, I've never seen them in the box before. These are the blueberry and they are by, looks like it says Sobisk. Um, and you get six packs. I was already in it. I already <laughs> ate a package of them. Um, but they come kind of just like the Belvita, like the name brand. Um, but these are the blueberry. And they come in like little packages and you get two little cookies per package. And it's, like I said, blueberry. And it is good until 10-31-2019. Um, so I like throwing these in my in my bag like just to keep in case I want a snack or I might actually just bring this whole box to work um so that's the first time I've seen them in the box like this and the, they're really good the blueberry ones were good from the ones that I tried but then they also had um columbina Col columbina the breakfast biscuits the oat oats and honey now this I bought before like in the package like this but they weren't oats and honey they might have actually been blueberry I don't even remember um, but this is the same idea you get six on the go packs and I believe oh this one you get three cookies per pack this I only had two cookies and this one there was only two so this actually works out better you get six packages and you get three cookies per package I don't remember that from the ones that I bought um, but I wanted to try them because it says oats and honey and I just thought that's going to be really good. I love anything with honey in it and it says it has natural flavors. So these were good the last time I had them. So I grabbed those that will probably come to work with me as well. Um, they do have a whole bunch of these little like small bags of candy. I actually got this for my son. Um, it's three ounces. I could have just gotten him a regular size candy bar, but I'd rather like moderate the amount of chocolate that he has in a night. And these are just like the little, the little tiny ones. So I grabbed him that. And then I grabbed, so I had seen these once before. Actually it was a few weeks ago, so I don't know if they got them in again, or it was something that they just didn't put all of them out the first time around. Uh, but I passed on them. It's the, um, the Yes to Cotton, um, it's the Mud Mask. So the first time around I passed on it because I saw Mud Mask. I don't do any type of Mud Mask. Uh, normally I do just She Masks. That's like my, my, um, addiction is sheet Masks, not Mud Masks. I mean, we've all seen the viral videos of like mud masks like ripping layers of skin and all sorts of crazy stuff but this was cotton and it says it's supposed to be um it says minimizes irritation and protects it says for ultra sensitive skin and allergy prone skin so to me that means it's like very very mild and not like the scary mud mask that i'm thinking it's gonna be so i did grab four Obviously, if I love them, awesome, I have four. Um, if I don't like them, then I obviously I can give these other three away, but a dollar for these is really good because at Target, um, I don't know if Walmart sells them, but I know Target sells yes to, so it's like yes to tomatoes, yes to blueberries, yes to carrots, yes to grapefruits, I have every, yes to cucumbers, I have all of that already. Um, but these are way more expensive than a dollar at Target so I grabbed four and hopefully it's not hopefully it's not scary I'll give you an update when I do eventually try them so then I grabbed these I have no idea what they are but that's 99% of the stuff I end up buying um they're called bonbons 
and it's like this little looks like a candy wrapper and these were up by the register um we have soda machines at the end of our registers and sometimes they'll put displays up on the top like the stationery sometimes pens you know they just throw some stuff up there um and I have absolutely no idea what it is, but I was intrigued by it. It says, collect me over 100 styles. Um, it says, unwrap a sweet surprise. And then it has these little these little guys in there. Um, it says, plum penny, banana anna, cream puff, carly, mint mindy, raspberry raquel, and juicy, juicy gemma. I have absolutely no idea what they are, but I did buy two. And I went ahead and... I took the wrapper off of one. Um, I didn't open it up, so I don't know what's inside. I just took the wrapper off. So we are going to see what this is. It comes in like a little, the little egg. Oh, it's a squ it's squishy. What the heck? Hold on. It has this little, it has this little paper. Um, oh, so this is a little checklist where you can like check them all off and I got a little elephant but it's like it's really squishy it's like those um oh no it, part of it broke off already it smells like an eraser like the erasers that you used to get in in school but it's really really it's like st sticky squishy like those those sticky hands that you throw. That's what it feels like. Oh, that's kind of cool though. Okay, so that's what they are. And this one's a little elephant. Okie doke. <laughs> Moving on. Um, so also. So these. I went back to try and find more. Now I bought these maybe... A week ago and then also a week before but I didn't buy enough stuff to do a haul like I really just ran in for like some like food stuff and they had these and these were so good I went back like three days in a row I've eaten at least three full sleeves of these these are so good I've only seen the strawberry ones um, and they were only at one of my Dollar Trees, but these are Special K, obviously Kellogg is a name brand, and they are pastry crisps. And in here you get two, um, like two bars, and it looks just like this right here. It looks just how you see there, and you get four in a package. So I have two brand new packages. I've eaten three full packages already. I eat one a day, every day at work. Is it healthy? Probably not. Do I care? Probably not. They're just really, really good. And it makes a really good midday snack for work. Um, also, again, my favorite cards for Poshmark. I just went ahead and uh, bought them all out as usual. As long as they keep getting them, I'm going to keep buying them. What did we get? Okay. So, super excited. I finally found some more new nails in my last haul I showed you the um Halloween nails that they had out for what is it LA girl or LA colors um and then there were some sassy and chic ones super excited about these so these are kind of like an Aztec print which We've had something similar to this before, and they actually had those in the store. But I have like a whole bunch of those because those have been out for like a really long time. Um, so I grabbed these, which I thought were really cool. You get 12, there's no glue, but like I said in my last haul, I used the super glue that they sell. So I grabbed um, two packages of these. And for these, one package does all my nails. Like I don't need to, the sizes fit perfectly. Like I don't need to buy two packs to um, be able to do one set. When I like a pattern, I'll buy like, you know, I'll buy a couple. Um, so that's those. Uh, these are the red ones that I had got. I put these on, um, on Sunday maybe. So it's been probably a little bit over a week that I've had them, I've had them on, maybe, 
it's been like a week um, and it's already starting to uh, you know fade away at the at the tip of the nail but for a dollar but I really like them so okay then I grabbed I absolutely loved this pattern these like pink and purple like leopard print I absolutely love these so I grabbed two packages of those I only grabbed one of these I think it's like the turquoise with with gold dots um, I mean nothing super exciting so I only grabbed one of those and then I really liked these I thought I grabbed two of them so they might be in another I might have some more in another bag thought I grabbed two but this is like a French manicure but it has like the red and black design I don't know if you can see it and this reminds me of like airbrushed stuff I used to get when I was in high school on my nails I don't know if you can see the pattern it's being kind of funny but it's like red and black and looks silver like almost not even not even an airbrush like it's painted it looks like it's painted on so I thought I'd grab two. We'll have to revisit another bag. And then tons of food. Okay, so they had, now I had to control myself because I literally almost bought all the cereals that they had. I had them stacked up like this. I had my son carrying cereal. But I didn't take a basket because if I take a basket, I just start like throwing stuff in and then I don't know what I'm grabbing because I'm not seeing it. So this was limited edition. This was the peach Cheerios. Um, you get 12 ounces and they are whole grain oats obviously but they are peach now i had got the what were they banana or banana nut i don't know i hauled them probably like a month ago they were disgusting i ended up giving the box to my parents to see if they liked it i couldn't do it um cheerios i normally eat dry like i'll bring a baggie of them to work and just snack on them like throughout the day and the banana ones, I couldn't do it. So I'm hoping the peach ones aren't the same way. But these are good until April 2019. Like I said, 12 ounces of name brand Cheerios. I don't even remember seeing these in the store, like in Stop and Shop. Um, but they are peach. So fingers crossed that they're good. Uh, then they had the General Mills Cocoa Puffs. Uh, limited edition ice cream scoops so it's uh, strawberry vanilla and chocolate flavored corn puffs um, these they look really good um, what are we at 10.8 ounces so these I will probably try dry I don't know if I would put milk in it I'm a dry cereal kind of girl um, but I stock up because my son loves cereal, you know, instead of eating a bunch of candy at night or like potato chips, like he might have a bowl of cereal. So, um, January, 2019. Uh, so I grabbed, I might've grabbed more than this actually, but right here is, um, two boxes because I figured if we like it and then, you know, they don't have cereal like this stocked for too long um this was actually on an end cap in my store um and then the birthday cake cookie crisp also limited edition um it's 11.25 ounces so it's birthday cake flavored again i probably won't do it with milk i'll probably just take it like this um my son loves cookie crisp um, I don't know if he's gonna like this birthday cake. He likes the traditional cookie crisp. Um, but this one is February 2019. So this one we'll have to get started on because uh, we don't have that much time on this one. But great taste of birthday cake cookies. I don't know. We shall see. I will give you updates on all of this cereal. Um, oh, so that I did. I bought another box of the peach Cheerios, another box of the, so I got three boxes of these. I hope they're good since I bought three boxes. And I grabbed the last box 
of these. So this is the family size and it's a pound. It says net weight is one pound. This is a pound of cereal and it's the Thin Mints, which are my favorite cookies from the Girl Scouts. Um, this is good until January 2019, but I had hauled the Samoa and my son absolutely loved them. He like killed the box within like a couple of days. So again, this is limited edition. I probably won't put milk in it. I'll probably eat it as is, but my son may put milk in it. But for a dollar, like how, this is crazy. This is a humongous, I mean, look at like the difference between these two boxes. So I was really excited. So this was at one Dollar Tree. The other one I went to, they had one box left, but the top was open and my son was all freaked out saying that somebody could have done something to the box. Let's not get it. I was kind of bummed out, but so because they didn't have that, he opted for these because he does like these. These are the Frosted Mini Spooners, which is kind of like the um frosted mini wheats it says love me or i'm free so there's a guarantee you could get your dollar back if you don't like them but these are the malto meal and it's seven ounces so what's our date on this nothing exciting here um april 2019 so i always like to have cereal on hand especially with my son um so i did grab some more tissue paper because they had they restocked on all their tissue paper so I grabbed two more things of tissue paper um, like I said before these were my favorite ribbons these look so nice on the packages they're sheer ribbon um, but it's like an ombre and it's three yards so like I said you can't do that many packages with them to be honest with you you don't get a lot not when you're wrapping the packages um, okay, so this is my favorite bag right here. Oh, I did get another one of these. I was going to put it in the car and I, I freaking, I forgot and I brought it in the house with me. Um, these are the air fresheners. This one is the ocean scent and it's the vinyl record. We were waiting at the register while the girl was vacuuming the floor. We had to wait for her to get done vacuuming so she can ring out the huge line of people that was waiting. So I just started throwing crazy stuff on the conveyor belt okay so this is my favorite favorite bag and I will tell you why so I did grab another one of these this Dollar Tree had a whole bunch of the black light responsive nails um, and they didn't have much of anything else so I grabbed what they did have so I grabbed I might have done two so these are the same ones I hauled in the other one they are the marble and you get 12 no glue included these the package was ripped but all the nails are accounted for oh so this is um called cursed these are called uh screaming and they are black and gold so they only had one so there's one gold accent and one with like gold polka dots they only had one of these. All the nails are accounted for even though the package was ripped. So I did grab that. Then, so as you know, I absolutely love the stiletto nails. Like they're my favorite to, to wear. I mean, they're a pain in the ass to type with, but I love the way they look. And we've hauled tons of them before. Um, but I found these uh, just at one of the Dollar Trees. So to me, these look pink with silver, black, and white. Um, look at how pretty those are. Those are so pretty. I love them. I can't wait. They only had one package, so that's what I grabbed. This one they had two of, and I'm so glad because I'm absolutely in love with these. These are kind of like, um, like a lace pattern, maybe. You know, there's like some filigree pattern happening. That looks like a dream. Yeah, there's dream catchers in there and they're light blue with white and black. Oh my God, I am absolutely in love with these. So they only had two packages. I don't know if there was other, like I said last time, I was probably late to the game. 
and there was a, probably a bunch of other packages like other designs that I missed out on um, which I haven't seen these since I bought the only two packages I think it was only two packages that they had so I'm really excited about these these are really pretty so I'm gonna be on the hunt to see if there's more of these because I will definitely pick up um, two like more packages of either one of these because they're really pretty and then so here we go yeah so I did grab another of the ombre black and red this is called stranger it says short length um, but sometimes I take a break and put short nails on which most of the time I have all right so I've been stalking for these and thought for sure I would never find them but I am so excited that I did it's the mermaid brushes you guys so you could get these on eBay for 99 cents um, especially these they sell them right now for 99 cents um, Poshmark if you buy them from a like if you're uh, an ambassador and you're able to buy wholesale um, they sell these um, to be able to buy wholesale for a ridiculous amount of money and people sell them for a ridiculous amount of money I came across a couple people that were selling these for like $25 to me that's crazy I would never pay $25 for a brush like this like you know not even like if I didn't know eBay sold them or I didn't know that Dollar Tree had them I would never pay $25 for this brush I think that's crazy to even charge that amount but how cool is this mermaid brush so it says this just says makeup brush um I mean to me you can use this as a contour brush um a foundation brush I didn't open it up so I don't know how the bristles are they seem maybe too soft to be a foundation brush but definitely a contour or just to decorate with like there's brushes that I buy that I just decorate with I don't actually use so this one says powder brush and I know it has mermaid scales on it but to me this is more of the unicorn like this is how the unicorn brushes are coming because it looks like a unicorn horn and then it goes white and purple so this one says powder brush super exciting and then this one says a concealer brush and it's the same thing it looks like the unicorn horn even though it's behind like mermaid paper and then this obviously is a mermaid tail um, I would say this is more of a unicorn brush but there you go concealer brush for a dollar so I hope they work super exciting um, so I grabbed a couple of those and then they also had these really cute mermaid makeup bags right it says cosmetic bag but it has like the felt inside it's not like the plastic like the other one so I grabbed some of these um, this one is like a turquoise greenish turquoise color and then they had purple these are really cool and then they had like a regular blue color look how cool that is I don't think they had pink I don't remember seeing pink um, but I did grab a bunch of the brushes um, I know one of the girls at work wanted some of them so I kind of just picked up a whole bunch I didn't buy out the whole entire um, plastic thing but these are actually in the makeup section um the Dollar Tree where I found these the makeup is on this side of the aisle and if you turn around on the other side it's like where the medicine is like uh yeah like the the back patches and the aspirin and all that and they were hanging off of um I think it was like two or three of those plastic strips not even right where the the makeup is but just right behind so yeah super excited about those so I don't know I found some really good stuff I'm super excited about the nails super excited about the brushes can't believe I finally found them but that is all I have um 
thank you so so much for watching don't forget to like this video don't forget to subscribe before you leave i will leave some stuff down in the description box um if you want to try thread up uh i have a code down there for you if you want to try stitch fix that's down there my poshmark closet is down there come pay me a visit over there um yeah so a bunch of ways to save money will be in the description box thank you again so so much for watching and until the next one